Okay, I'm back for the final demonstration on the resonance charger. So this is the battery in question under load being recharged. I have removed the capacitors, so there's nothing hooked up on the system, and I'm going to show you the draw of what the system uses. Just the way it is right now, 1.54 amps. Now, I've turned it off. I'm going to go ahead and connect the capacitors. There's one. Two. We have it on the hot lead before the capacitor and before the coil. So this is the actual draw coming in from mains. So we're going to turn it on now. And there's our draw. 895 milliamps. So, and we're at uh, 1477 on the output. Okay, so that's great. We're gonna unhook this. We're at 887 milliamps. Let me take it off of there. We're going to place it on the working circuit. And we are working at 5.5 amps. Was on my bad, 1.55 amps. So that's the working circuit, and the input again is 0.88 milliamps, 880 milliamps. All right, I just wanted to show you what it draws from the wall, which is basically what you're seeing here, 1.534. And that is because of this battery. If I had a larger battery here, I expect it would draw more. This battery is, you know, junk, right? 14.64. So, uh, I haven't tried any other batteries. Maybe I'll get a large battery and try that and do one more video for you and see if these numbers change much. But at present, I have 1.55 amps in the working circuit on the primary of this coil a transformer and from the mains I am supplying the device 893 milliamps all right that's about it see ya